Science. It is a search for life beyond our planet Earth. In February this year, an international team of scientists confirmed the existence of such a planet. It is orbiting round a red dwarf star every 28 days and is just the right distance from its home star for a moderate climate. This means the water on the planet is liquid, not ice, and the surface temperatures are expected to be similar to the Earth. So, perfect conditions for supporting life. It is a discovery which has had a huge impact on the scientific world. For astronomers, it is their holy grail. The planet is about 22 light years away from Earth. So what's behind this discovery? Is it the possibility that scientists will be able to see this planet? Astronomers have analyzed the data of the telescope HARPS, the High Accuracy Radial Velocity Planetary Searcher. It is one of the world's best extrasolar planet hunters and is situated in the southern part of the Atacama Desert in Chile. Detecting this planet was a time-consuming process. It could only be found in an indirect way with the so-called radio velocity method. In fact, the planet's gravity causes small wobbles in the orbit of the star around which the planet turns. State-of-the-art telescopes are able to measure these tiny wavelength shifts and can indirectly confirm the presence of a planet. HARPS has a 3.6-meter ground-based telescope. It has helped researchers of the ESO, ESO, European Southern Observatory, to discover more than 50 new extrasolar planets in just one month the largest number of such planets ever announced at one time. Astronomers of ESO assume that every star in our galaxy has at least one planet, many of them located in a habitable zone. The main activity of our research group is the search and study of very small planets, planets with a mass of the Earth or just a bit more. Our work will be the basis for future space missions, which will look for extraterrestrial life. With the new generation of instruments, researchers will be able to analyze many similar stars with habitable planets and eventually look for signatures of life in one of these worlds.